The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesavento, afternoon update. Uh, we're taking a look at these markets are under a great deal of pressure. Anything financially related, the U.S. dollar is soaring. It's really gone ballistic, uh, euro collapsing. Uh, we've had a drop in crude oil down about 6 or $7 a barrel the last few uh, uh, trading days. And then also we've had a big drop in gold from a high of last week at uh, 2080 all the way down to 1990. And silver hit the magical 382 number uh, today at uh, $23.91 uh, per ounce, just part of what's going on. And the other market that is uh, come under a great deal of pressure, which you would think would have some followers here, but it's the bonds. The bonds and notes are going down. That means they are probably expecting some short-term interest rates to go higher. That's usually the case as you see that going through. The only markets that are up today, and that's only marginal, is we have natural gas up about $8, and we have a very small rally in hogs and a very small rally going in also in cattle. The grain markets, the only grain that is up is the May near nearby corn. All the other contracts, because of the crop report that came out today, uh, is signaling you know, lower prices in the corn and wheat and beans, and maybe that's good for inflation, but that hasn't tallied up to the stock market yet. We'll have to get more information. Remember, this is the first big report of the year, crop report, so there's many more to come. And like I've said many times, I've never gone through one year where we didn't have at least two or three crop scares over my 60-some years of trading. So a lot of things are going to happen over in that grain, the grain growing area, just like we have in the financial. A lot of things will be happening. So volatility is here to stay. Make sure that you use stops. It's not how much money you make. It's how much money you don't lose. And focus on that, and you're going to be just fine. Ask yourself, can I afford the risk? If the answer is yes, take the trade. It doesn't make any difference what your trading system is. If you can afford to take the risk, Take the trade to so live every day in an attitude of gratitude and may God bless.